Hi, this is Gali Goldfarb and welcome to my Gorilla Life Coaching videos. Five times a week I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier and happier place for you and I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. So how are you doing today? I hope you're feeling humble because today our quote of the day is, humility is not thinking less of yourself, it's thinking of yourself less by C.S. Lewis. Humility is not about having less self-esteem, but rather about having the understanding that there is still something new to learn every day and that there are other people who, whom we can learn from and gain and improve as a result of. It is an understanding that you are not at your best yet and there is still so much to strive for. In relationships, it is not new that nobody likes an arrogant braggart. Humility and vulnerability make us much more likable. And we know that in order to reach our full potential and to be our happiest, we have to be in good relationships. A lack of humbleness and humility will ruin any relationship. And a lack of acceptance and respect for another is a death to any relationship as well. The same is also true with children. Time spent will, with the children makes one more humble because it reminds us from where we came from. Humility is also great for having the understanding that your children are not your extensions, but rather that they are their own human beings and may have different points of view and different interests to your own, and this is absolutely legitimate. We are all small compared to this wondrous, amazing world around us. And when we understand this, we learn how to release and surrender many things. And this is very good for our mental health and the health and having a healthy state of mind. Humble people are people who attract others to them because they are more likely to admit their mistakes and they don't take credit for other people's accomplishments. And these characteristics are not only attractive to others, they are also a factor of success for both the individual and inside an organization where the individual works. Being humble also allows you to learn and improve because you don't think that you know it all. Uh, a person who is humble is aware that they do not know it all. They understand that they do not have all of the answers. And when a person thinks that they have all, the, uh, all of the answers, then this really takes away curiosity and learning stops. And this hinders growth. When we are humble, we are more open to new ideas and more open to change. And in an always changing world, this is a very valuable gift to have. Humble people also pay more attention to what is going on around them, uh, proven through research. And humble people also take advice from people, from other people, especially experts. And this increases intelligence and success and paves the path towards better as you see reality as it really is. You really see where you stand in comparison to where you desire to be in a much clearer way. And you also know yourself much better and you see where you stand. And these are necessary first steps towards any progress and improvement in life. Now, the coronavirus pandemic has also been a precursor to lead many people to become more humble. Even people of power who are not used to following other people's orders and regulations now have to follow them for the sake of other people, for the sake of the health of other people. Now we see that we cannot be arrogant in the face of this pandemic and that we need to change and follow at times very uncomfortable rules and orders. The coronavirus has really allowed more people to become more humble and to learn this very important virtuous trait. Admitting, admitting, admitting fault is not easy for anyone, but this is a trait of humbleness. In fact, bosses who know how to give other people uh, the credit and take the fault when, when they make a mistake are the most loved bosses. And this is important to know since these types of bosses are seen as better leaders and they are followed by other people more gladly. They also have better listening skills. They listen to the workers and this makes people more happy to work for them because they are not being given orders. 
Denial of what is because of seeing things through arrogant eyes can be very destructive and have a very destructive effect on your future. So self-esteem is definitely something you want to have and harness for your gain, but having a sense of humbleness that others can be of help and can teach you much and can help move you forward is a trait that we will that will make you much more likable and more successful in the long run. There is not one or the other. You can be self-confident and still be humble. And the way to ensure that both of these, uh, that you have both of these characteristics is by loving yourself as you are, but still accepting that there is progress to be made. Only a truly humble man can be free and can surrender to what life gives them while seeing themselves through realistic eyes. So as I always do with these videos, I will provide you with a question that you want to ask yourself so that the answer will help move your life to a better place for you. And the question of the day is, what can I do to improve myself? That's a very simple question. And when you ask this question to yourself and you answer it, then you understand that you are not quite where you desire to be. And when you understand this, you are humble and continues to strive to become better. As usual, I recommend writing this question and your answer to it in a notebook, especially prepared for these coaching sessions to make sure that you are moving yourself to a better place for you. So to finish this video off, uh, I want to finish it off with an affirmation. And the affirmation of the day is, I see things through realistic eyes and see myself as I really am, and I am humble. I see things through realistic eyes and see myself as I really am, and I am humble. Now tell this to yourself as many times as you remember to do so today because an affirmation has the power to transform your life and help you become the person that you really desire to be through repetition. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please also subscribe to my channel and ring the notifications button to get notified every time I upload a new video, which is practically every day. Also, please uh, visit my website, The Gorilla Diet, to help you move your life to a better, healthier place for you. Thank you very much for joining me.